good morning. It's my favourite part of the day or time of the day. The morning. It's about seven o'clock in the morning. Oh, what a morning. Got a perfect sleep. A few mozzies around, but nothing too bad. But yeah. Not really, uh, not a breath of wind this morning. A few people look like they're up by the pool, but... Let's go have a look and see if there's any action. Go get me morning coffee. Let's see what's going on. Hello. Hello. Good morning. Salamat pagi. Hello. One of the kids in the pool already. Let's see if there's any surf. There's a few people that, um, there's a couple of mates that have met me here. Not sure if they're up yet, but uh, they've all got their surfboards here. They reckon they're gonna take me surfing or we're gonna go somewhere with surfies. Let's see that. She doesn't look like a too bad a wave. Just out there. Whoop. That's what this resort's apparently famous for for the surf. So, a couple of guys going out. But yeah, beautiful morning. Got all the uh, people, little fishermen. I don't know what they're going for in there, little crayfish or... So all these boats that are out there apparently going for little lobster and crayfish, little baby ones, and they take them back to a farm and feed them up. Feed them up to get them nice and fat. So anyway, that's the view this morning. I'm gonna go get a coffee and start the day. So I'll check in with this later. Did you eat breakfast? Yeah. We've just been, uh, we've just been taken in a car with some locals and have a look at this view. Oh my God. That is a view on top of a, a mountain. I've just asked what the place is called, but the owner's, uh, the owner's showing uh, some of the people we're with around, so have a look at this. Absolutely beautiful. Perfect. So here we're off. I'll find the name of it, but we're in the top of a mountain in Lombok. <laughs> and literally little dirt roads. And then we've just come to this, in the middle of nowhere. Unbelievable. I'll go upstairs. What do you think, Laris? It's so beautiful. Really? Yeah. Good view? Yeah. I'll go upstairs and have a look. What's what's this place called? What's this place called? What is it called? What is what is this place called? Siwa. Siwa. Siwa Clubhouse. Siwa Clubhouse. Right, just trying to see where the guys went upstairs. No, that's the bathrooms. Just trying to find where the guys went. <laughs> I'll find it, don't worry. Here we go. So it looks, I think it's pretty brand new, this place. Looks like it hasn't even really opened yet to the public. Here's the owner here on the left, the t-shirt on. Whoop. Just went through the wrong door. Well done, Benny. Yeah, see like there's just a dirt road that got us up all to here and they're still building here. Yeah? Wow, 
was that? Unreal, yeah. yeah. Now that's a view. <laughs> Got the girls posing. <laughs> Love po love posing. <laughs> uh, yeah, Instagram. <laughs> Here we are, we're just about to go for a swim. Just one more quick look around. Got the music going. Laris is getting ready for the uh, swim. Relaxed atmosphere. That's our mate there with the bald head. He's just opened the place and then COVID hit. So could you imagine that? Opened a brand new place and then COVID hits. Oh, Lara, it's going in the pool. <laughs> yeah, I'll jump in too. Yes, I'm taking it. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Very wussy. <laughs> now time for the big bomber. Bye. We're off. We're going to uh, look at some a resort, I think for sale, villa. Yeah. Yeah, mate. Yeah, no worries. <laughs> yeah. We gotta look at the villas up top. Gonna go look at some villas for sale. He's just gone straight up and over. The just workers up there. Wear, really <laughs> See, we are here. Looks like a little pool outside. Look at the views from there. Hey mate, how you going? They start from 400,000 and they go to 900,000, depending how big they are. I don't know what this is, but ask us to have a look. Have a little look. Two story. Yeah, they look cool. So what do you think, Laris? You want to buy one? No, I'm not interested. Not interested? You like it a bit closer to the beach, do you? All right, I'll, I'll let I'll let them know. I'll let them know the feedback. Yeah, okay. <laughs> we'll have a look at the view up here, though. Oh, getting a bit gnarly in here. Hey. <laughs> the v the views the views are uh, next level, but. Yeah, it'd take you uh, 20 minutes to get there on a scooter <laughs> to the beach. Now start the boys going into their golf cruise or something mm. playing golf with them. Not sure what this That's beach is called. Maybe Maui Beach, we're not sure. But it's definitely a beach. All right, we're gonna go down. I've just broke the pack. They're in a chin wag. Me and little wee mate, Devon. 
So hello, buddy. Hello. We're gonna go check out the uh, check out the surf. Time time to get in the green room, I think. Hello. Got a little garden here going. Hopefully it's a garden and not graves. Anyway, Sempiak Shala. It's like a little yoga yoga room or something. Here it is, the Lout Beach Club. Maybe it's called uh, Sempiak, guest only. Hello, how are you? Beautiful beach, eh? Hello, my friend. Good, beautiful. What's this beach called? What is it? Selam Balanat. Okay, thank you. I will not be able to say that beach name again. I'll need a bit of practice. Thank you, my friend. We're all coming down. So yeah, don't ask me how to say that uh, the name of that place, but. Uh, I will get it and I'll try to get a photo of it. Oh, it looks like there's a photo here of it. Let's see here. There we go, Salong Belanac. Salong Belanac Beach. Once again, beautiful. Uh... Beautiful uh, beach. Here we go. Hopefully get something to eat and drink. It's a beautiful place though, and there's a good little beach beach wave here too. Anyway. Gonna get some food. I just got a soy or soto ayam, I think they're called, which is like a chicken local soup that we've got a few times. Laris is cool, got a uh, satay, chicken satay. And thirsty, jeez, I'm getting some drink. Get a huge water and Sprite. Boom. Beautiful uh, little surroundings though here. I really like Lombok, I'm quite impressed. Beautiful place. Here comes Laris' satay chicken. Thank you, mate. Where's mine? Bloody hell. Here it comes. Soyo chicken. Well, that actually looks good. Yeah. It's a good look when there's a lot of sauce in there. <laughs> mm. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Oh. Beautiful. Thank you very much. It's a little bit of chilli there too. I like. Perfect. So a little bit of the, one of my favorite soups. Mm, very nice flavor. Good. This cool little thing that is put on our desk gets rid of the flies. You little beauty. It's a nifty little uh, device. They got them on all the tables at our friend's table here. You beauty. What do you think of the sardo? You like it? Tasty? Lunch, just finished lunch and just come down the beach and a pretty normal sight. Whole herd of water buffalo coming along. Have a look at this, eh? Big bloody herd of them. A few cows, water buffalo. <laughs> Can we eat one? <laughs> that was pretty crazy. It's out of nowhere, all these water buffalo just come along. We've got Laris now doing a bit. Wants to do a bit of a photo shoot, but he runs quicker than me. <laughs> Anyway, it looks like I'm gonna have to go do some photos here. Yeah, that was pretty crazy out of nowhere. Water, all these water buffalo just started going along the 
the beach there. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa, a bit of dancing. <laughs> All right, a bit of excitement there. Laris has done a bit of a photo shoot. Oh. Now we are going back. She's like, she's buggered. She's been dancing around. But, uh, yeah, so I've learned today, all these boats here that are everywhere around Lombok just scoop up little baby lobster and crayfish. And they do 12-hour shifts, apparently. I don't know if that's true, but the guy explaining it said they do from sun uh, from sunset to when the sun rises, then they swap over with the crew. So the boats just stay there. They just keep trying to... Um, net or scoop up baby crayfish or lobster and the um they all the babies get sent to china alive and then they get fattened up fattened up in aquariums and then they get sold when they uh when they're big enough so yeah it was interesting and then at night they have all the lights up and they get a lot of squid so yeah it was really cool anyway go back and uh, see the guys but it's still pretty dead here. Look at it all, oh, like, that would be full normally. This is the most popular beach in uh, Lombok too, apparently. So it's pretty quiet. So this is day two of Lombok. I'll try and get a video of most days, as long as something exciting happens. There we go. <laughs> and we are done for the day. What a ripper. Now we're heading back to um, Sagara Lombok Resort, and uh, actually the 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 manager just uh, messaged me saying someone cancelled on those beachfront villas, so I'm going to do a quick move and live the high life for a bit. I haven't asked him how much it's extra. I think it's only like twenty dollars. So I'm in my last few weeks of Bali, so let's live it up. I know Laris wants to. Uh, she, was, she said she was keen on, on, on going on the beachfront too, but anyway, it's mainly because I want to do it. <laughs> All right, heading back. <laughs> We've got a full, full load here. Big man driving. <laughs> the Movember. I know. I didn't know that. <laughs> Two k's to go. <laughs> just did the count. We got 11 people in the car, which is just legal in Lombok. 12's no good. <laughs> Look at that for a view. Wow. It's great views, but probably just that little bit too far. Yeah, you know? Oh, there's some land, isn't there? Just going, grab a yeah. surfboard and walk straight out and surf. Yeah. Right there. Here we are. What? Beachfront, Sagara, Lombok. <laughs> Quick dinner and now dessert with some friends. Yeah. <laughs> it is almost. <laughs> oh, you little beauty. Thank you, mate. Perfect. Wow, we.